the hell is going on here? You guys are insane. So of course I went to Beth's yesterday and I wanted to just show off everything that she's just sort of lugged off onto me. Um, there's like these that are some dresses. So this is like a yellow dress that pretty sure hasn't been worn. So fun. I'm going to have to try that on at some stage as well as this one. It's a little bit more weird in texture and things. Label maker. Cool. A uh, pretty useful hair accessory kit. Some lipsticks that she never used. So lipsticks. Great. A little bag what I can put stuff in. So I'm probably going to put like SD cards and things into this whilst I go to college. A few books that she's actually just sort of lugged off onto me. What means that I can read them. That they're going to go off my shelf. What means it's a part of my uh, library collection that I'm slowly getting through. I need to read some of the books today because I started uh, to think about wanting to create a business. And then that all came in this bag, what is a uh, Ted Baker bag. I know Ted Baker is a reasonably expensive brand, but it's, uh, that's all I know really about Ted Baker. There's not much that I know. Also some bras, um, helpful for especially whilst I am so transitioning and hopefully will be on hormones soon. This is a LED mirror light, so it will, if I open it up, comes with a lot of batteries. But this is a LED vanity mirror light. So it should allow me to be able to get some really good view whilst also using the correct camera. <laughs> correct phone. Uh, what actually apparently still works is the Hawaii uh, P30 Lite. Uh, I got a Pixel 6, so I don't really need it. But it's also the case of might as well because I can try it out, see if it works and see about replacing the screen and then probably sell it. Maybe something. I don't know. <laughs> a new skirt. What? You know what, let's put it on. There you go, that's the new skirt. It's actually pretty nice, it fits on me pretty nicely. So. Some straps, what allows me to be able to strap uh, new bags and things. Another skirt, well, I'm not sure about this one, but I'll try it on. Some basic Yu-Gi-Oh cards, what, I have never played Yu-Gi-Oh, so maybe I should learn. This little picture 21 thing, I'm not 21 yet, but... Maybe, maybe I should get a picture for my 21st. And then uh, another bag, because why the hell not? So there's one constant that sort of goes through my head when living in this place. The constant is pretty simple. I need to sort out this place to the point that I feel like it's a home, but I also need to make it so that it's neat and tidy. So what is the best way to do that? So the thing is, I have a lot of stuff, and that lot of stuff means that I rather have things that I don't need and don't want. I want but don't need at all need and I guess want as well because I sort of have my needs and wants so we're gonna go through things slowly throughout time to be able to try and sort out everything um I'm gonna do my desk for the moment also I hardly have any time to be able to actually work on this video what means that uh I hope that it's enjoyable either way I'm very bad at creating these I <laughs> I need to work out what I'm doing for days that I'm not doing anything So inside my house, I have two floors. I have like the ground floor, or like number one, let's just call it. And then we have the, the, the top floor, also known as like two. Let's go with the ground floor very quickly and let's go through what we have. So this is the base of the ground floor. We have stairs, what goes into like a doorway here, what then goes into the, the sitting room office area that I'm trying to do, what is here, where we are at the current moment. You are here. So this is going to be like a big office area. What comes around to this side, what there is my desk. This is my desk over here. So this means that I can then like go to the kitchen easily because this is the kitchen. So it's kitchen, office, and then this is where the stairway is slash like door where that mirror is that I keep them doing the weird thing with. Then over here, right down here, is a spare room. This spare room is typically a dining room but I'm not planning on using it as a dining room because it's got drums and stuff in. It's going to be like my music room where my uh, brother has all of his musical instruments. All the walls are going to be white. We're going to use smart things to be able to make it so that you can like turn on and turn off lights because I enjoy that. As well as hopefully in the future, Google will accept sensors and things like that so we can walk into a room, sensor turns it on, has it on a timer of maybe 30 minutes. And that means that my cat can go through and light up the whole uh, place. Back here, back where the kitchen is, there's a decent sized garden, uh, what sort of comes around in a while. But there's, there's plans for the garden, but that's not till like spring, so we're not worrying about that. We're worrying about downstairs, maybe a little bit of upstairs. So this is upstairs. You 
walk up the stairs here from downstairs and then you come to a landing, well, sort of goes around. And this right here is a bathroom. Then right... Ta-da! <laughs> then right here is my second bedroom. This is, this is a spare room at the current moment. I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing with it. It was going to be originally my office. It's a pretty good spot for an office if I was to create the sitting room into an actual sitting room again. So this is an office. Might be, uh, might be a dressing room at some stage. Might be something more towards a cinema room or even a like audio room where I do a lot of audio work and things like that. I could probably create something like a small studio in it, maybe, or make it into a library. Then up here is my bedroom. So my bed is right across here, right here, and then I have my little wardrobe thing here, and then there's like more wardrobe stuff there, another big wardrobe here, and then there's there's like a chair here, and this is like a little thing. Um, also there's a cupboard here, but uh, because it's above the stairs, it's very strange. So that's my bedroom. In here, this, this has got a lot of floor space, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it. I might just leave it as floor space because it would be good for VR. I've currently broken my controller, so it's really annoying. And then in here, I have like, some stuff across there. There's some boxes over here, some boxes over here, some boxes over here. There's a chair here, some boxes there. There's another chair there. There's another chair on top right there. These are doors here. What well, goes into like little cupboard spaces that most of them are not full. What well, means I should probably put all the boxes in there. Then right about here, uh, what's near the door is actually the way to get to the loft. It's very strange. I have already been told that I could put stuff in the loft, what means that I should probably get up there at some stage. Maybe that's our goal, <laughs> to, to, to put things that we don't want, at least for the foreseeable future, in the loft, what means that I don't have to touch it. That might be our way to just cut things down that I, I'm like, I'm not sure if I want to get rid of it, but it's also the case of I can't really do anything with it. Then, I, of course, you got a view of the front, and you also have a view of the back garden. Are we on the same lines? So I'm not sure if we're on the same lines here, where I want to go with a simple design. But there's a lot of rooms and one me. The goal is to do this over time. This could take five years if we need to, but it's also the case of, as you can see in this room, there's some texture around the walls, I don't know if you can see it. But it's not the best, and on top of that, I need to like go through, sort out chairs. So there's chairs like this, or uh, not the chairs that I would go for. Uh, to say the least. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of work, but we're gonna get there. I think I think that explains my my plan for the house uh, My house plan if you will uh, so I hope that helps. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day 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 Wake up Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day.